Dash it behind the Hershey cage. Went under three minutes to play in the first. 0-0 on the Penn State House scoreboard. McCormick to the left point for Bean. Changed the angle and shoots. One, it got blocked and bounced in. Now that's unfortunate. A shot from the blue line got blocked and then pinballed into the net off the Bears defender. Jake Bean let it go. He'll lead him down the line. It's 1-0. Charlotte to the blue line again. Gus. Last side, slap shot coming and deflected off the back glass behind the goal. That one let go there by Gustav Forsling, the former Chicago Blackhawk. Cloakening, waits behind the cage, wrapping it out from behind the goal. They'll throw it in front, off the goal, post rebound score. Well, that was far too easy, wide open, Dave Gust. Has goals in back-to-back -back games against Hershey. Yanni Cloakening behind the net, just slowed it down, and this line remains hot for the Checkers. They make it 2 0 with 20.6 seconds left of the first. Game in Cleveland, since then they've been masterful. Here's Johnson Fialmi with it for the Bears along the left wing. He'll leave to Garrett Pila. Nifty move, the net powers in, gone, goal, and scores! Garrett Pila, an early strike in the second period. He walks to the net himself with a beautiful individual effort and slides it low underneath the Delkovich. The Bears have cut the lead in half. It's two to one in Charlotte. Jack Hill melted down, and they're going to tell him to move it. No one in a red sweater around, so Vitek has to play the puck and we roll on. Bears look to clear it. They cannot. Held in. Checkers throw it towards the net. Man, a check will play this one away. Give it away to Forsling, and they score. They should have blown that play dead. Williams absolutely irate the officials. Vanacek had it covered. They wanted him to play it. I understand why they wanted him to move it. But the goaltender wanted a whistle. He had to play the puck. They made him move it. And seconds later, it lines up in the back of the net. Colby Williams, irritated with Matthew and Eddie, smashes his stick over the goalpost. Dean to the penalty box. Here's Bean back to the right side. Checkers with it. Wrist shot got blocked. Alexia got in the way in the left dot. Checkers will get it. They center man wide open. Wrist shot score. From the left side of Flutterer from Kasky. Might have been tipped into the net over the glove of Anacek. And Charlotte leads 4-1. to one. Kasky again. A knuckler. He had two yesterday. He's got another one. And the Checkers now have a three-goal lead. Those dollar beers stacked up. They're enjoying this one. It's been physical and it's seen four. Charlotte goals to one for Hershey. Juice behind his own net. Did not get a lot of the pass. Gave it away. The Checkers will take it in center and score. Beautiful pass. Open into Lorenz. And this line continues to be red hot for Charlotte. It's 5-1 late in the second. Two big home games where they've been one of the best teams in the league. The second most home wins only to Hartford. Going to have to try to get back on track. Unless there's some miraculous in the 820 to make me eat my words that's remaining in this game. It'll be a second consecutive loss for the first time since November. Here's Mayan over the blue line. Right side, snap shot. They score! Brian Pino makes it 5-2 with 8.09 to go. Just wide. It's Wickle on the left point. Centers in front, deflected down low for Pilon, swatting away at it. He put it just wide of the cage again. Pass to the left pad. To the point, Colby Williams with it. Drags it on the blue line, it waits. Left side, Witko walking in down low. Deflection, they score! Matt Molson, it's a two-goal game with plenty of time left. Down 5-1 in the third, they made it 5-3 here. Maya to take the draw, O'Brien Molson out there lined up behind him. They win it too. Brian Pinto winds and fires. He scores! Right off the faceoff. It's a one goal game. Brian Pinto, second of the period. A laser right off the draw. With the extra attacker out, it's 5 4 with 3.03 to go. Don't go anywhere yet, folks.